Traffic is down to one lane near McHugh Creek, while work once again begins on the rocks along the Seward Highway. It's hard to miss the giant excavator scraping at the frozen ground. Crews are removing part of the cliff to keep it from hitting the road. It is a very high potential rockfall area that we really feel strongly about getting taken care of. For the next few weeks, the work will center on taking out part of the rock face just south of McHugh Creek. Yeah. It's like the most prominent section of rock in the worst possible place. The plan is to blast it about 20 feet back. Workers say it's safer to do in the winter when the ground is frozen and also when beluga whales aren't running in Cook Inlet, which is right across the road. If a beluga was right next to the right next to the shoreline when the blast went off, it would injure them. The work means flaggers will be out keeping traffic to one lane and delays may be several minutes long. They're asking people to use patience while the work continues to try and make the highway a safer place to drive. Right now, crews are working 12 hours a day, seven days a week. That will continue at least through the end of March, probably into April. And the work continues this summer, but they will be taking weekends off, so the highway will be completely open. For Alaska's News Source, I'm Lauren Maxwell.